The smell of sweet and spicy barbecue is filling downtown Fort Wayne. Rib Fest is in full swing now at Headwaters Park, and News Channel 15's Alyssa Ivinson is live in the middle of it all. Well, all the big heavy hitters from across the country are here again this year, and several local vendors are here as well, including a new one this year, Bruno's Barbecue out of Columbia City. It's the food, it's the music, it's the atmosphere, it's Northeast Indiana's biggest outdoor barbecue. Ribfest has rolled back into downtown Fort Wayne, and the fun and food are just getting started. Around 40,000 people come every year and feast on more than 25 tons of barbecue. Hi guys, welcome to Ribfest. New to Rib Row this year, Bruno's Barbecue. I like the process of the barbecue. It's a process, it's not the sauce. Bruce Lemke's been trying to get into Ribfest for years. He finally got the call. A smaller banner than some of his neighbors, perhaps, but he's not intimidated. We can compete with the big boys. For the small restaurant out of Columbia City, the secret to the meat is all in the cooking process. We dry rub them, we don't sauce them. And we smoke them and we put the sauce on the side. They're juicy enough, flavorful enough with uh, just a rub on them. While big rib masters travel hundreds of miles to be in Fort Wayne, it's important to the organizers to leave room for the locals. The Lynn Nationals are here for four days. Then they pack it up and they leave town. They're heading over to Naperville, Chicago. The locals are here and we can enjoy it 365 days a year. And you can come down and check out all the vendors at Rib Fest. It goes through Sunday at Headwaters Park. Live at Rib Fest, Lois Ivinson, News Channel 15.